Jam School Remix. You're gonna look like a psychic who knows the future with tic-tac-toe. Let's play some tic-tac-toe. It could be two against one. You guys can work against me, but the only advantage I ask for is I get to be X. Probably not a surprise that we tied. And what's great about this is you just sort of you sit down and you play an idle game, but it doesn't really get interesting until you notice that before the game even began, I had a feeling that it would end up exactly like that. That's pretty good. Pretty good. There was a mathematician and a genius master of magic named Martin Gardner who would write all these brilliant mind puzzles. This is a trick that he wrote up and a friend of mine showed it and it fooled the pants off of me. The game really is totally fair. You just play a legitimate game of tic-tac-toe. The only thing you have to remember is anytime they play in a corner, you play in the square clockwise to it. If they play right here, you go in the middle. If they play right here, you go in the side. If they play, if they play right here, you go in the middle. If they play here, you go in that middle. If they play in the center spots, then you play in the spot counterclockwise to it. If they're right here, you go into this corner. If they're right here, you go in this, 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 and here it goes right there. If you follow those rules and you go first, the result will always match this prediction. So all you have to do is memorize this configuration. In my mind, the name of the tricks is Oxo, Ox, Zox. There are situations when the prediction won't exactly line up. For sake of discussion, let's say this was the first place you win. Now if you look already, this doesn't match. But we play by the rules and do the exact same thing. If you turn the prediction, it's still exactly matches. So there's no way to play the game where it doesn't actually match up. You, what you need to do though, is before you turn over your prediction, you need to make sure that you see how it's set up and that it matches the same orientation to get the uh, Oxo Ox Zox. Now remember, the key to matching the prediction is that they have to be playing tic-tac-toe. They have to be trying to win. If they know you're doing some kind of prediction effect, they might want to do nonsense moves. So make sure you don't tell them what's coming. Scam School Remix brings you the best of our nearly nine years and 500 plus episodes of Scam School. You can check out the original episode this came from or watch the entire Scam School Remix archives. They're full episodes that have been shrunk. They're freeze dried. We're like the beef jerky of Scam School episodes. They were big and fat and juicy, marbled, and then they got pressed and now they're tasty. 